Hi, this is Erin with Erin's Art Channel. I, um, I haven't posted in a while, but I have been making a lot of art as usual, and I finished quite a few pieces that I'm excited to show you. Um, and a, a couple things I'm working on too, I'll show you that. We'll start with Ramon, because he's right here. Uh, this is a Roadrunner. I sculpted the body out of clay, and the tail, the tail is actually sculpted separate, this piece right here. Um, there's a dowel connecting the two, and I also used Bondo, so that's not going anywhere. I mean, that's on there. And um, these are, his legs are made out of a galvanized steel wire. Um, and they are, oh, there's also a hole drilled, so they're Bondoed in. But um, he's not finished, obviously. He has a little ways to go, but I got him standing today. So I'm happy with him. He's for my mom. Anyway, that's Ramon the Roadrunner. We'll lay him down so he doesn't fall. And then I'll show you some pieces that I finished. Okay, so we'll start with Judy Sherry Berry. Um, I did show you the sculpt to you guys a long time ago. I don't know if you saw in the earlier videos, but she has been painted and sprayed. Very little painting. I just painted the eyeballs and darkened some areas and highlighted some other areas. Um, she's completely hollow. So you can see, and she does hang on the wall. There's a wire to put her on the wall, and that wire will hold 100 pounds, so she's not going anywhere. She's up. Um, but yeah, I'm very happy with the way she turned out. Um, mostly the coloring of her is the natural clay. So that's Judy Sherry Berry. She says hello. And then I sculpted a javelina, or what I intended on being a javelina, which is a desert boar. It did not turn out to be looking anything like that, but we're going to keep the name just because. So this is javelina. Um, Kind of an egg shaped just hollow just hangs on the wall like that like a nail or something and um get you close so you can see the face i feel like this bear mask is re reflective of the time we're in with covid because we all have to wear masks so it's just kind of like a lighter a light-hearted take on it and the egg shape i think happened because we're kind of all being our lives are being reborn like we're all gonna rehatch into something. But this is Havelina. Super happy with how he turned out. And then I'm doing this Empath series. Um, and I did a couple of smaller ones. So this is Joseph Jackson. He's hollow all the way through. Um, but I painted him. Again, I didn't paint it much, I just highlighted it. Mostly he is the natural color of the clay. And he just hangs on the wall with this little hook in the back. Joseph Jackson, he says hello. And then this other empath I made, this is Rita. Rita is also hollow. And she has an amethyst crystal. Um, that, uh, amethyst, very good for healing energy. So I like having that on her. Her face um, is actually built out of a different colored clay or a different type of clay. So that's really naturally how it looks. Uh, and I like that. I like to keep the color of the clay because it's just, it's so great. So I don't want to hide it. And I paint them just highlight and natural. And this is Rita. And this crystal, I mean, that's in there. It's not coming out like it's pretty solid. I try to make, I try to do my building really solid, good builds because they belong together. Yeah, Rita. Um, and I guess I'll stop there. I'm working on a lot of other things, but I'll come back to it later. So thank you for tuning in. I hope that you're happy doing whatever it is that you love wherever you are at. Um, I'm just going to keep making art and it's just good to connect. Have a great day. I hope you're doing something that you love. Bye.